Hello everyone, my name is Peter. I am from thesupportzone.com and the purpose for thesupportzone.com is to offer bookkeeping services to small business owners and entrepreneurs. Okay, so in this video, you can see by the title how we can transfer the QuickBook from one computer to the another computer manually. Okay, there are different ways to move the company file from one computer to the another way to the other computer. But this is how I will going to show you like I will show you how it will going to move manually and safely. Okay, so in the last to last video, you saw how we installed an older version of QuickBook. So I will going to take the same version, which is QuickBooks Pro 2019. Okay, the same thing will gonna work with the versions you are using at the moment. Let's say the latest version if I'm talking about here, let's say you are using 2023 or 2024. This is how the way I'm gonna show you it will gonna work in the same way to the latest and supported version of QuickBook. Okay, so let me quickly go ahead and open QuickBook here. And this video is going to be conducted in three parts. I mean like how it will gonna move or how we will gonna move the QuickBook in three parts. Okay. So the first part is create a backup of your company file. Then download and install QuickBook on the second computer on which you want to use it. And the third restore the company file on your second computer. And most of the users generally use or generally transfer their QuickBook onto the second computer when their first computer is no longer working fine for them or the purpose for doing like moving the QuickBooks on the second computer. Either they are setting up like multi-user license for their QuickBooks company file. Okay. So so I have created a video like how you can set up a QuickBooks multi-user access easily. I will like the link of that video is mentioned in the description. You can see that video to set up the QuickBooks multi-user license. Okay. But in this video, let's go ahead and start with the first part, how to create a backup for a company file. So this is a sample company file I opened. So first we need to, uh, we need to go to the file menu, then click on backup company and then click on create local backup under this it says local backup let's click on next and then we need to browse to the location where you want to save the backup so i will gonna save it onto my external drive okay let's say local disk yt okay that is considered to be my like an external drive like a thumb drive or a pen drive if i say and let's click on okay and then let me click on okay again and then we need to click on save it now and then click on next and then click on save here as well. Okay, so it will gonna check the data integrity issues. If there is some kind of an issues going on with the company file, it will gonna let us know about everything. Apart from this, it will gonna save a backup in a minute or two, depending on your company file size. If the file size is big, it may take some time, but generally it take two to three minutes to do this uh, job. Here you can see it. QuickBooks has saved a backup of the company file and the name of your company file would be mentioned with the location as well. Let me click on OK here and OK. So let's go ahead and close QuickBooks desktop here and let me take you to the location where the company file backup is saved. Let me take you to this PC and here it is. OK, so this is the backup of a company file. Here we can see it. OK, now we need to restore the same file into the another computer. So let me take you to the second computer and I will show you how I can restore the same company file on the second computer. All right. So let me quickly switch it to the second computer now. Computer on which I already installed QuickBooks 2019 which I was running on a first computer. So let's consider this is our second computer on which we are going to use QuickBooks from now onwards. Okay, so I have already installed QuickBooks here as you can see. In order to download and install QuickBooks, I have already created a video. That video is also linked into the description. You can go ahead and check it out if you want to see how to download and install QuickBooks on the computer. So let's say you install QuickBooks here and you want to restore the same company file. So let me open the QuickBooks here and as QuickBooks is about to be in cycle open here, it is something for this video purpose. I opened my old laptop, which is kind of a low, but it will work for this video purpose okay and apart from this one more thing here in case you're looking for some kind of a quickbooks bookkeeping help 
please do reach out to me and i will be there to help you out with that all of my contact information is mentioned in the description as well all right guys as you can see here quickbooks is open and let me quickly go ahead and restore the backup that we got from the first computer into the external drive okay so let me quickly go ahead and click on other options here and let's say you are not getting this window here okay and uh, you're going to get this window like this okay so you need to click on open or restore an existing company let's click on that then click on restore a backup copy local backup that was a local backup we created and then let's click on next and let's go to the location where the file is located for you so in my case i created that backup in an external drive so local disk f and this is the local backup that i created and let me click on open here and uh, let's click on next and let's click on save here we go so it is restoring the same data file or restoring the same company file it will gonna take a minute or two to restore your company file and what is once it is completely restored you can see if the information is there all kind of information is there or not like such as your bank account your invoices your customers data your vendors data and all that so right now like as i said this is my old laptop it seems to be working very slow if you can see the cursor is scrolling on and on and so once the file is open you just need to go through with it in order to see if all the information is correct that's all you need to check and that's how you can easily transfer your quickbooks from one desktop computer all right guys you can see here company file is about to be open so let's go ahead and wait for this one you can see this is the same sample file that i took for this video as an example but the same thing can be done with your official quickbooks company file all right this was all about of this video where i mentioned or i show how you can move the quickbooks from one computer to the second computer if you have any doubts any questions you can comment below and i will reply to that and apart from that if you are looking for some kind of an assistance with quickbooks bookkeeping or anything related